Vince Neal, and you are watching Expose. Expose, baby. All right. Good job. Hey, this is Susan Russell from Expose. We have this today on Expose. Vince Neal, the lead singer of Motley Crue. Stay tuned for more on this on Expose. How hey, this is Susan Russell from Expose. We have this today on Expose. Vince Neal, the lead singer of Motley Crue. I am so excited to be here. He was up on stage. He sounds awesome. So tell me a little bit about this tour, what you've been doing. Uh, it's not really a tour. We're just uh, kind of playing some shows here and there, you know, for the next couple months. Uh, but we're going to, I think we're going to do a, uh, like a 30-city tour towards the end of summer or like, like July-ish. July, August, something like that. Um, you know, uh, probably going to go to Europe with Motley in June. So, and I have like a bunch of records I have to record, a Motley crew record, a solo record. So it's going to be a busy year this year. Now that's awesome. Aren't you going to be going to the Download Festival in England too? You going to make a stop over there? I think we might be playing there. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, yeah. I guess, I guess I'll be there. That's awesome. That's yeah. awesome. Now, I, I hope so. Yeah. You better be there, man. We'll be looking for you. All right. Now I know like Motley Crue was a huge success with their comeback, you know, Red Rock and crew thing and you guys are actually one of the biggest um, selling tours according to Rolling Stone magazine so you want to tell me a little bit about that tour how you know it's probably like the beginning of where you're at now well I mean uh, the tour lasted it was uh, we started in February of 05 and we ended in December of 06 so it was almost two years two years long you know but it was in three different segments you know the last segment uh, was with Aerosmith right right and uh, that was a lot of fun you know it was a long tour but but uh uh, you know, we had a great time going out there for that long, so. Definitely, and you had like some fire eaters and kind of wild stuff, right? Yeah, well, it was a circus, you know, it was a carnival of sin. So we had the dancing girls, the trapeze art, trapeze artists, uh, midgets and fire eaters and all kinds of that goofy stuff that goes along with a creepy circus. Right, well, Motley Crue is always putting on a great show. Now, you guys are going to be putting out a new album like in 2008. You've been writing a lot of songs for that, right? Yeah, working on stuff right now. You know, everybody just, you know, the tour was so long that it was just kind of on vacation from each other right now. Everybody's kind of gone their own way. But, um, you know, we'll hook up and rehearse a little bit at the end of uh, March or end of May, I mean, for the for the, uh, for the the, the short tour in, Euro in Europe. And then we'll start uh, laying down some tracks. Awesome, awesome. We can't wait to hear those. Now, you're going to be going to Australia with the solo tour. Am I right on that? Uh, yeah, Australia, Hawaii, uh, U.S., Canada. Wow. Awesome. So have you been to Australia before? Many times. Okay. <laughs> well, talking about been that. Down under all the time. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's like the home of reality, you know, ever since Survivor. So, talking about that, um, aren't you going to be doing like a reality series with A and E? We're working on something right now that, uh, you know, when it gets a little closer to it, we'll okay. we'll, uh, we'll keep quiet now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But we'll. But I just, yeah, I heard some rumors like Las Vegas wedding or whatever. Parents moving in. I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure yeah, it out. Yeah, we'll figure it out. You'll see. We'll talk about it soon. Yeah. Now, talk about that. I mean, obviously you get around on TV here on Expose, you've been on VH1, A&E, and even the Food Network has you blending margaritas. So tell me a little bit about that. Aren't you kind of launching some tequila? Yeah, the tequila, tequila's out right now. It's uh, it's called Trace Rios. Um, we have three different types of tequila. Oh, well, we all got to get a hold of that. <laughs> this is the, the Añejo. Uh, and uh, this is then we have the Reposado, which is like medium taste. And then we have the, uh, the silver which is like good for blending. Definitely. It's, it's just, uh, it's very clean taste. Okay. And stuff and a little picture of me here. Awesome, and yeah. Join a margarita, a little story of how it got started. I don't know. It's yeah, tequila. you guys better get a hold of that tequila, you man. I mean, it, if awesome. Vince is pushing it, it's his thing, you know. It's, now, I, this is, you know, this is my stuff. Uh, my, Vince Neil, uh, my Vince Neil tequila. Awesome. So it's cool, you know, it's, it's uh, so, if you drink tequila, drink the rock and roll tequila. You know, drink, uh, drink you know, either or, drink, drink the Trace or the Cabo Wobble, you know it's coming from a uh, good rock and roll or something. Right, and, and yeah. Vince definitely knows how to have a good time, so obviously <laughs> yeah. it must be really good tequila. We're all going to, you know, have fun with that. And didn't you kind of look through the rivers of Mexico to get the best agave nectar? You really kind of worked hard to find it. Yeah, Want to tell us yeah. I mean, I was riding horses through the agave plantation. Whoa, that seems romantic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Unless you've seen an agave, they're just like, they look like giant swords. Okay. But, um, yeah, yeah, right, you know, going through the agave uh, fields and tasting the different, uh, the different tastes 
from the different agave plants and the way they're processed and stuff. And we found a, just a great way to make really, really good tequila. And we actually uh, make it in um, outside of Guadalajara. Wow. In a little uh, little town called uh, Tlacapaki. Okay, that and sounds really romantic. <laughs> yes, little cobblestone streets. And it's it's really cool, but but it's a uh, it's it, it's a uh, most of the tequila in the in the world comes from that little region. And it's um, okay. Well, Vince is teaching me something I didn't know any of this. This is awesome. <laughs> so you take on a whole different strain. That's really really yeah, cool. Yeah, there's a whole thing about tequila. It's uh, and it ends up tasting really good. Definitely, definitely. Now talking about that, I mean, tell me a little bit about the, that Motley Cruise because I'm sure <laughs> that would really work out to be on a cruise. You know, sipping some of your tequila. So you want to tell yeah. me a little bit about that? Well, we just finished the uh, the cruise in, in January. We went to um, a three day cruise in uh, to Nassau in the Bahamas. And um, we're going to do one again next year. So we have a four-day cruise goes to from Miami to Key West, Key West to Cozumel, and back to Miami. So uh, we're going to do that and have a. I'm going to play and get a couple other bands to play. And well, you know, uh, um, Hooters sends like 30 of their girls for uh, bikini contests. And so we have, we have wine tasting, tequila tasting. We have a poker tournament on board and wow. all kinds of fun stuff. Sounds like fun. Yeah. I think anywhere Vince is, there's fun. So is there anything you want to let your fans know about what's been going on? Anything you want to let them know about the tour? <clears throat> wow, that was it. That, that, that's really it. The tour stuff. I mean, that's all I really know. You know, it's uh, right. right now we're you know we're here here in um, you know the Chicago area and, and um, having fun. We're so happy to have you here. And you're in the Hollywood Walk of Fame now, huh? Yeah, we got our star in the Walk of Fame, which is cool. Definitely, definitely. we yeah. all got to go down and see that. It's that's right awesome. From the uh, porn museum, so it's okay, perfect. Okay, just where he belongs, right? <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I am so excited to be talking to Vince. Neil. I talked to him a couple years ago. He is back in town. I had to go see him. This is Susan Russell from Expose. Stay tuned for more of this. Hey, hey, this is Vince Neal, and you are watching Expose. Expose, baby. All right. Good job. Good to see you again. All right. Man. Good Thank to see you. you. Too. Right, take care. Hey, hey, this is Vince Neal, and you are watching Expose. Expose, baby. All right. Good job. On eclectic stuff. I don't know what it is, but I'm sure I can move to it. Let's do it. And I want you to watch Expose.